Good afternoon. I wanted to do this at the house, but I had to pack a million things and she was holding me up. That's all I got. So episode three, the final episode. What do you think? Episode three is awesome. This is where shit gets real. You start incorporating what everything that they've learned and putting it to practice on the field and they have to work as a team and actually they're under attack. They have to try to make it through. I've seen teams do really well at this and I've seen teams do really bad at this. You know, you you have an objective and then you have to, it's a casualty, you gotta, you take a casualty, you gotta get them out of there. And a lot of people get sucked into it. Meanwhile, you're in an engagement or you get into an engagement and either everybody's sucked into the engage to the engagement or they're sucked into the casualty. And you know, bad things happen because you have to be able to task organize, you have to be able to work to it together as a team and accomplish those goals. You know, looking at it like a family. So somebody breaks into your house, how have you trained your family to react? How have you how does your family know how to work together in your home? Similar concepts. Like you always say, you can train on a line and everybody can train to shoot on a firing line and okay one two three everybody shoot at the same time but when you're in a high stress scenario how is everybody going to react and you kind of separate the men from the boys if you will i try to stay a little bit more pc with it and nicer but she just kind of laid it out there all right enjoy episode three let me know what you think Live pressure. Oh. Here we go. That that should be almost as tight as a tourniquet. Look at this. At this point, what you don't want to do is lose control, and now you're overwhelmed by events, and you don't know what's going on. There's blood everywhere. Step across. Cross to you once you're set. to conduct a patrol uh, down one of two two trails that we didn't know which one. Uh, there was a casualty at the end of it. We basically got a debrief from the medical officer on what was going on with the casualty. Um, mission was to get the casualty, stabilize the casualty, move out to the heel zone, and uh, call for call for nine line and get out. Uh, we took contact about maybe a minute and a half after we uh, started assessing the casualty and uh, taking care of what needed to be taken care of. So after that, it was a break contact bounding overwatch and uh but we took we took shots from two sides a lot of us had some gun issues um but that's yeah. real world that's real world and yeah. i think we did very good because i think you guys did stellar we would have been all shot in the back if we would have been sucked in to the casualty in the first yep. place but because we had the wherewithal to have a good medic team and then a good security team we did very well we set up a uh little hasty linear ambush along in here um object was to let the um, let the participants come through and get as far as they can because that's their safe other harbor site back there to get back to. Uh, Nick, initiated. You want to? Yeah, basically, I let them get as I let them over penetrate as much as possible, so that they were kind of caught towards the tail end of the of their uh, patrol. So they kind of had to fight back through it to get back to where they were going. Um, they they did really well though. Stuck together. They didn't, they didn't separate. They, yeah, they, they communicated. They didn't separate it, uh, any any of the part of the team, um, and they worked really good to to bound and, to, and maintain a, a rate of fire. So uh, yeah, they did good. Hi.
that's smoke check. Very, very exciting. Probably one of the most, one of the courses that I'm most proud of. It was, it was just over the top. I would love to be able to do it again. We've got some really good plans in the future. I've got some really good friends that want to see this thing happen on a larger level. So go watch them all. Drop us a comment. How do they? How do we make it better? How do we more, make it more exciting? Should there be explosions, vehicles, more fighting? I don't know. Whatever you guys can come up with, drop us a comment. Let us know. Thank you guys so much. Uh, again, the links are below for all those instructors and everything they have going on now. I'll uh, see you guys next time.